Hello and welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna to talk to you about books, okay? I know it doesn't sound very exciting, but trust me, these three books, if you were to purchase them, read them from cover to cover, you are gonna learn so much about land navigation. Almost to the point where I feel that these three books are probably all you need. Now there's hundreds, probably thousands of books out there all around the world that have been uh, you know, produced on land navigation. But these three books that I'm gonna to talk to you about, I feel are my, my top three. Okay, so um, let's get started, shall we? First book we're gonna talk about is this one. Mountain Craft and Leadership by Eric Langmuir. I hope I pronounced that right. Uh, it is the third edition. I'm not too sure if there is a later edition. I've had this one for years. You can see here, it's starting to fall apart a little bit. But uh, I use this a lot. You can see here, it's used by you know the Mountain Training Board. You know, it's got some big names attached to it here. Um, you can pick these up super cheap now on on eBay for a few quid, or you know if you wanted to get it off Amazon and stuff like that. It talks all about your basic navigation, map reading skills, all your compass work, general things that you know you 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 want to learn about. But the reason I've picked this book is because the rest of it has got a lot of stuff about general sort of mountaineering and hill walking. So you're getting a fantastic book for, for you know, your land navigation, but you're also getting some other stuff thrown in for extra. Really good book, this. Uh, it's been used you know, for, for many years now, and I, I still pick it up from time to time and just have a bit of a swat up. So the second book we're gonna talk about is this one here. The Natural Navigator by Tristan Gooley. So I was recommended this book uh, a couple of years ago now. It is really interesting. Okay, so as the name sort of suggests, it, it goes right into detail about, uh, you know, all the sort of the moon cycles, the sun cycles, you know, it talks about the stars, you know, in the different hemispheres of the planet. It talks about the wind and common patterns that happen around the planet, you know, like migrating birds or animals and you know what rivers and streams do throughout the years and stuff and it, and it gets you really focused on the nature and the natural side of what's happening on the planet and how you can use these you know to, to aid you in in your navigation uh, so you know this compiled with the information and the technical side of things that you're learning in a, in a book such as this is, is going to be absolutely fantastic um, so I definitely recommend this fascinating book you'll be able to read it and you'll just be like that's amazing honestly it's amazing and you'll learn some really really good skills which you can use all over the planet and uh, and just learn a lot more about our nature and the planet itself at the same time so definitely recommend this and it's even got the legend himself uh, you know giving it a thumbs up basically. The perfect book for getting you started on your own adventures. All right, Ranulph Fiennes, okay, if it's got his name on it, then uh, yeah, it's gonna be good. So that's book number two, definitely you should pick that one up. So the last book that I wanna suggest is this one here. Okay, The Ultimate Navigation Manual by Lyle Brotherton. But if I was to recommend somebody one book for land navigation, it's this bad boy. I mean, look at that. I mean, that is a big old thick book and that is just land navigation. If I just show you that, look, it's all colorful, glossy photos. Absolutely beautiful book, this one. Now, when I went and did my land navigation instructor's course with the military, I got issued this book on the course and constantly throughout the course, I was picking this up in reference to it. I mean, this book goes into so much detail. It starts off with all your essentials, you know, like how to fold a map, how to take bearings and grid references, all the stuff that you would expect in a land navigation book. But, uh, but then it also goes on into, um, you know, your special environments that will go into, you know, extreme cold, it will go into the desert, jungle navigation, things like that. And then it goes into GPS. If, if I was gonna recommend somebody just one book, this would be the one. I'd be like, you have to get this and have it on your bookshelf all right? and you'll, you'll just pick it up from time to time and just go over bits and pieces that perhaps you've forgotten. But this video is all about recommending three books. And I do believe that between these three books, this one, 
okay you know with a bit of technical stuff in there and some uh, mountain stuff and some hill walking thrown in this one you know you're going to learn some of the natural side of things about the sun the stars the moon the rivers wind all that and then this one for just full-on you know getting your mind blown by uh, by technical information what i'll do is in the description below i'll put a link to to all of these three books so if you do want to purchase them then uh, you know just just click the link and uh, and go buy them but anyway i hope you enjoyed this video uh, if you did you know give it a thumbs up think about subscribing and i'll be back soon with some more content if you have a book that perhaps you've read that you feel like should have been in my top three then you know put a link to that below I do have other books. I'm always keen to read other books. It's just that I feel that these three books are my, my top three and you can't go wrong with them. But anyway, take care and I'll see you soon. Ta-ra.